Hi, good day folks, and welcome to the Believe It Show, where Believe It, if I can get to this day with a big smile on my face and true personal independence in my sights, well, Believe It, so can you. Hey, today is Friday, Father's Day, June 14, 2019. I'm broadcasting from Fernandina Beach one of Florida's true hidden treasures. And believe me, folks, no one, I mean absolutely no one, knows about this place. It's its almost in Georgia. That's how far off it is. So it's truly hidden. And I'm looking at you laying in that hospital bed. Let me ask you, how are you doing? Okay. You hungry? Okay. You feeling okay besides that? Did you get a good workout today? Oh, oh good. You did 20 sit the stands and you walked with your walker for 200 feet and you walked with your cane for another 200 feet. That's a good day working out. Did you work out your arm, your your weak arm? Oh, good. You did it on the wall, the crawl on the wall, the finger crawl on the wall. That's a good exercise. What well, great. Well, I bet you're hungry, aren't you? You're starved. Well, let's go over a good idea for a menu for you. And we're going to start this menu off with a good salad. You can use spring mix or you can use romaine and tomatoes and cucumbers and a little bit of cheese, some cheddar cheese or Parmesan cheese. And you can use some ranch dressing or Italian depending on your taste and you want to don't make it too wet you want to taste some of the vegetables and then you can have some soup now what I would suggest is using uh, Progresso makes a really good clam chowder or you can use uh, Italian wedding soup from Progresso is very good. They have several good soups. And for the entree, I would eat pretty light. You use a, like a chicken breast. You know, grilled chicken breast or grilled pork chop. And season it real good with salt and pepper. A little bit of garlic salt and for vegetable I would use broccoli. You want to make this al dente. You want to bring it to a boil and as soon as you can pinch through the stem, take it off the heat. Take the broccoli out of the water also to cook. The longer it sits in the hot water the more to cook and you want to just take it out of the water and you can season it with butter or salt and pepper it's fine I like it just like that some people might want to use ranch dressing you can also make some hollandaise take some uh, egg yolk, one egg yolk some lemon juice, a half of a lemon salt and pepper and a couple of dashes of Tabasco Melt some butter and heat it up on the stove. Take the cream out of it. Or don't put the cream in the hollandaise because it'll make it thin. If it gets really thick, then you want to put some cream in it to thin it out. And then it's, the cream has some good flavor in it too. But you want to heat it up so it's kind of hot. Not boiling, but pretty hot. 
and you can make it right in the blender, just like that. It's really good. It turns out really good. Use a whole stick of butter, and you have a nice holiday sauce. And I would you put that holidays on my chicken too. If you take some tarragon leaves and add some wine vinegar to those tarragon leaves, you can take a little pinch of the tarragon leaves, put it in the holidays, and it turns into Bernays sauce. It's very good with chicken, fish, beef, pork chops. Excellent. And, and then for dessert, I would have just some fresh fruits. I would use some melon and uh, strawberries, pineapple, apple. Just have it with that. It's really good. And you know what? I hope you have a good dinner. I just wanted to give you an idea of what you can have to eat. And remember, if you have any questions at all, don't hesitate to reach out to me at BillLeavitt1962 at gmail.com. That's BillLeavitt1962 at gmail.com. Remember... Believe it, if I can get through this day with a smile on my face and true personal independence in my grasp, well, believe it, so can you. Thank you, folks, and you have a good day.